lights burn late in the Daiichi building in Tokyo, headquarters of United Nations Command, as General Matthew B. Ridgway, heading the forces of the 14 participating nations in Korea, considers military terms under which a ceasefire might be negotiated. The general is authorized to act for the United Nations in a meeting already agreed upon by Red leaders who suggest Kaesong, just south of the 38th parallel as the conference spot. Even as General Ridgway attempts to speed the date of meeting, the scars of a year of bitter warfare and the scourge of disease spread over the peninsula. Anniversary in Seoul. Here once were nurtured hopes for a unified and free Korea. A shell-riddled capital building is symbol of the fierce battle half the world has waged to keep those hopes alive. While men seek desperately for a peace formula, the struggle goes on grimly as troops stand to arms and the world prays.